All right, so here it is. It's that time of year where we are going to do our final pack opening in MLB The Show 18. Don't get me wrong, we're going to be ripping a lot of packs in MLB The Show 19, but this is definitely going to be 100% the last pack opening I do on video for MLB The Show 18, and I figure we're just going to throw all of our stubs at it. Uh, it looks like it's only going to be one 50-pack bundle just because I only have 25,000 stubs, and these are 25,000 stubs, so we're going to rip that, and... We are also going to rip our final guaranteed finest pack that we are ever going to get right there since we won 50 Battle Royale games. It took a while, but we ended up getting it. And uh, yeah, we're going to rip these in this video. Hopefully, we get some diamonds. Hopefully, we end with a bang. But we got 50 what? 51, 52 total packs looking for one diamond. Who knows what we're going to get? But if you enjoyed the video, slap the like button. But let's get into it. All right, so here we go. Yeah, we're just going to rip all of these, and then I guess I'm going to rip the finest pack randomly in the video at some point. I don't know when we're going to do it, so you guys are going to have to stay tuned and see uh, and see when we do it. Oh, I kind of forgot we got these packs, too. Um, so who knows what's in, like, these holiday packs? We're going to save those for probably the end. Well, let's get ripping, baby. we got to get at least one diamond. Why is that? There we go. I had double volume, dude. Are you freaking kidding me? What is wrong with me, dude? But yeah, man, we're looking for at least one diamond outside of the finest pack. So no matter what, we're going to get a uh, a guaranteed diamond out of that. But I hope we get something, just one extra bonus diamond in here somewhere. I hope it's like 99 freaking Mike Trout, even though that's impossible. But it would be cool if we actually got him. But let's go, baby. Come on, baby. Give me something juicy. Give me something juicy. That pack was incredible. It has been actually a long time since I've done a pack opening. Like, I don't even remember when we did it, but it was a while ago. Like, 100%. It was a long time ago. But uh, we have not pulled anything too good yet. I mean, we got plenty of packs left. Plenty of packs left. Come on. Come on. And can you get packs inside of packs in these? I can't even remember. Um, I feel like if we got one of those, it would already have been popped up. And I don't see it. So, yeah, I definitely uh, I definitely did not get any packs inside of packs, which sucks. But whatever. I mean, we got like 45 packs still. So, we'll be okay. But come on. Come on. Give me one diamond here, brother. Just one. Just one. I don't even know what cards are good anymore. I'm assuming Mike Trout, the Life Series Trout, was still the most expensive Life Series diamond that you can pull out of packs. But then again, I don't know, dude. I haven't even been paying attention to the market at all. Like, I haven't even added a card or taken a card away in probably like two months. Ever since I got Jose Ramirez and uh, like Lindor and all, the, all those guys, I haven't even thought about opening packs because there's really no card I want. I mean, I got all the finest cards pretty much. And I'm pretty much set. Like, the only card I would like right now is maybe Finest DeGrom, maybe Finest Scherzer. Um, I guess I'd take Christian Yelich, even though I have no idea where I would even play him. So, I don't even know what I want. That thing literally goes for zero. I'm not even looking that one up. But I have no idea what card I actually want. Literally no clue. I got no clue. But hopefully we get something good. Uh, but it's not looking too good as we have not pulled a single gold. I don't even know if we've gotten a gold equipment. I probably have like a uh, like a ritual or whatever, like the gold perfume or the gold freaking sandal. But, I, dude, it's not looking good. Hey, there we go. That card like last year or two years ago was like a lot of stuff. But that's not anything this year. Come on, baby. Give me some. Give me something good. You would think San Diego Studios, since the game is, like, coming to an end, um, they would make, like, the odds of getting a diamond, like, super high. Like, if we don't get a single diamond out of these 50 packs, what are you doing? The new game comes out in a month. Why don't you want people to spend all their money on these packs, you know? Just an idea. Just an idea. And, yeah, man, MLB 19 is so close. A little over a month to go. And we also have RBI Baseball coming out, like, the beginning of March. And uh, there hasn't really been any gameplay shown for it just yet. Um, there's a gold Royals jersey. That's freaking dope. But that, uh, wait, that is like the first time I've ever seen not getting one card with an actual, like, card art on it. Are you insane? Is that insane? Jeez. Okay, well, but, uh, yeah, RBI Baseball comes out March, like, 5th or something like that. Like I said, there hasn't been any gameplay shown on it, so I have no idea if it's going to be good or bad. No clue, but I'm definitely going to try it out if you guys want me to. Um, just play that until MLB The Show 19 comes out. And then if you guys like it still, I'll keep posting. That's our second Wade box. Come on, bro. But if you guys like RBI Baseball, as even when MLB The Show 19 comes out, I'll be posting both. So you guys just got to let me know. Um what you guys want and then also the IRL videos are going to be coming back don't even sweat it we're just waiting for baseball season to come back um because it wouldn't make any sense to post 
a uh, baseball video, not during baseball season. It just wouldn't make any sense. But I have literally no idea how many packs we have left. I don't even have the slightest clue. But we, oh, there we go. Finally got a gold. I think that was an 83. So that is probably, uh, Beltre? Is Beltre an 83? Who's an 83? Springer. I know that's not George Springer's card art. I can, like, see this card. Is it Votto? No, Votto's a diamond, isn't it? Yeah. Um, dude, I think that's Beltre. It is Beltre. Wow. Okay. I'm pretty smart. I'm pretty freaking smart, baby. All right, how many packs do we got left? Probably, like, 20 or so, maybe. I don't know. Looking for, uh, looking for something, dude. We've gotten one gold. Dude, if I somehow go through all these packs without getting a diamond, that is going to be, like, ridiculous. Dude, that is going to be insane, man. There's got to be a diamond sitting in there somewhere. There has to be. How can there not? You know? There's got to be something. Got to be. Right? I think. Maybe. Come on, dude. Come on. Maybe our best card is just sitting in this guaranteed finest pack. I hope it's one that we don't already have because if it is... That's just going to suck. But if this one we don't have, I can lock him in. And I think we might be able to get another guarantee or get another finest pack from the uh, the finest program. But I have no idea. Uh, we just got to all hope that it's not like Lindor, Baez. Um, we just got to hope it's one I don't already have. And hopefully it's a good one. DeGrom, Yelich, something like that. But with my luck, I'm probably going to pull freaking uh, Lorenzo Kane again. But where are these diamonds? Where are these diamonds? Like, bro, what do you want me to do, game? What do you want me to do, game? I don't, like, bro. Yeah, we are running out of packs. We have not gotten anything yet. There we go. We got back-to-back -back golds, which is cool. We have actually only pulled one gold card. Like, one decent gold card. Maybe in our uh, our pack, like, our themed packs, like the camo pack or whatever. Maybe there's, like, a really expensive bat or something. That's why we haven't pulled anything good. I don't know. But it's not looking good. It is not looking good. And also, I really hope it will be the show 19 has like some sort of uh, like award or reward, whatever, or I guess award in this case for um, for opening packs. Like if you open a thousand packs, you get like a guaranteed diamond pack or a stub bonus pack or something like that, just to give you some incentive to rip packs. Because dude, there's a certain point of the year where there's no reason to rip packs. Unless uh, unless they start releasing really cool cards next year, then there's always a reason to rip packs. But like, like I said, once I got like, uh, all these finest cards, there was literally zero reason to rip packs. So, I don't know. I think it would be a good idea. I don't know how hard it would be to implement into the game, but that's why I'm not a video game designer. But, dude, this is not looking good. We have literally one, like, what is that? 11 packs left before we're in our themed packs, and we haven't pulled a single diamond. That is atrocious. Dude, this is, well, is going to be one goal. Could you imagine if these were full price? That would be 50,000 stubs to get one Adrian Beltre card. That is terrible, dude. Like, that is horrible. Bro, give me something. Give me something right here. Just pop out that diamond. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay. Okay, this, this is looking good. This is looking real good. Chris Davis, good player. Really good player. But the card's worth literally zero stubs. Come on, dude. Come on. I literally burnt all my stubs, too. I have 1,004 stubs left. That ain't going to cut it, man. That ain't going to cut it. Wait, shouldn't I only have... A th Wait, shouldn't I only have four stubs left? Right? Because I had 25,400. Or I had 21... Wait, I had 25,004 stubs. And these are 25,000 stubs. So why do I have 1,004 stubs? I didn't sell anything, did I? Yeah, I definitely didn't sell anything. That's weird. The F? Yeah, I don't know why I have uh, an extra 1,000 stubs. Maybe I had 26,000 stubs. I don't know, but I'm pretty confident I only had 25,000. But this is our final standard pack, and we did it. We went through 50 packs and only pulled one gold. And here are our final four packs. We have a camo, a finest, a Halloween, and a holidays pack. This one is probably the least expensive because it's Craig Kimbrell. Maybe we'll get something good. We get the lizard skins. Okay, um, I don't know how much those are, so we're going to go look real quick. One stub, okay? That's, uh, I don't know if that's the best one, probably. Are you kidding me? Dude, so bad. All right, now we're on the camo. Dude, I'm just flying through these. Come on. Come on, camo. The glove. I know that one sells for literally nothing. I don't think that's the most expensive or the, the like, the least expensive, but I definitely know it's not the cheapest. Yeah, that one goes for five. Okay, so it's tied with the cleat. That's dope, Okay. So there we go. Over two. Open packs. We're going to rip the Halloween one. 
See what we get here. Come on. The batting glove. Okay, maybe the batting gloves were something. Uh, no, that one's six. Okay, so all of our themed packs, we've gotten about like eight stubs worth, something like that. That's good, but we are on our final pack, our last finest pack of the year, I think. There might be one more, but we're not gonna rip it on video. I might just rip it like randomly and like a battle royale video or something, but this is definitely 100% the last pack we are opening on a dedicated pack opening video. So right now, slap that like button. We've had a lot of ups and a lot of downs this year with packs. The finest, or the guaranteed, uh, or sorry, the live series packs, like the normal standard packs. We haven't really pulled anything good this year. Uh, like the years before we pulled Trout, Kershaw, all that stuff. Didn't really pull anything too good out of them this year, uh, from what I remember. But our finest packs are pretty good. We got Lindor, we got Baez, we got JD Martinez. Like, we've had some good pulls, don't get me wrong. But uh, hopefully next year, the, the normal standard packs are a little bit better. But here we go, our final pack, our final pack of the year. This is it's kind of sad, man. So many stubs wasted. But hey, it happens, you know? I do it for you guys. So make sure you slap the like button. Slam it. Just a thousand likes. I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I doubt it. But maybe. Just slap the like button. Here we go. Our final guaranteed finest pack. Let's see what we get. Going for, uh, going for someone good with it. We already have uh, Freddie Freeman. Well, I definitely don't have this card, but that's not a good one. God dang it, dude. I wanted a pitcher. Hang on. Let me see. We might actually be able to do one more. Um, let me see if I have enough. Do I have enough to collect nine finest? No, I'm one short. So that might be it, boys. That literally might be it. Yeah, I don't have enough to buy him, and I'm not going to. So that is probably our final pack opening of the year. It's kind of sad, man. That's kind of sad, but I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, like I said, slap that like button. Only got one good card here, and it was freaking Freddie Freeman, which is one of the cheaper, finest cards. That was a terrible pack opening. I really wish it would have ended on a better note, but hey, it happens. But I'm out here. Like I said, if you enjoyed the video, slap the like button, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Uh, peace. I